Cubase 7 introduces a completely redesigned mixer with tremendous capabilities. It's called Mix Console. It has a dedicated full screen mode for use across multiple monitors, and it's entirely scalable. To the left, you can see the new View Sets and Channel Zone tabs. View Sets allow you to control which channels are displayed to keep large projects under control. The Zone tab lets you control the layout for your channels. You can now add track icons to the mixer for at-a-glance navigation. The new Control Room tab gives you access to headphone and monitor setup right from the mixer. You now have channel search capability to locate the channel you need no matter how many channels you have. Adding plugins is easier than ever thanks to the new quick access control. This window also has search capabilities built in to find any plugin with a few keystrokes. The new meter section contains all the tools you'll need, including EBU R128 compliant loudness metering. This also includes a loudness range display to better monitor the overall loudness. Plus, there's a new mixer overview window which provides mini peak meters for all channels. You can now create and assign effects channels from inside the mixer. Another great help is the AB compare function. And the global bypass for all audio effects. The new Mix Console also has excellent sounding modules built into every channel. This means you don't have to open multiple windows for basic channel functions. You get a complete set of high pass and low pass filters, a 4 band Studio EQ with Spectrum Analyzer, a noise gate, standard tube and vintage compressors with dedicated gain reduction meters and a sidechain key in, an envelope shaper for dynamic punch, realistic tube and tape saturation, and finally, every channel also comes with a brick wall limiter and a loudness maximizer. All of this means you'll spend less time on setup, leaving more time for mix down. The new mixer speeds up your workflow in other ways too. You can now drag and drop settings between channels, and you can easily recall your favorite settings, be it an insert chain, the new channel strip, or the whole channel setting. You also get 350 presets designed by US producer Alan Morgan. Open the channel settings window by clicking on the E button of any channel in the project window. In Cubase 7, the channel settings window gives you control over anything for the channel. This includes control of the send effects, Q sends, equalizer, and even the channel strip itself. You can change the order of the channel strip modules by clicking and dragging any module from its current location to any other location you want. You can even move the entire channel strip between pre and post insert effects by clicking here. You can view and control the output chain, and you can show or hide the output chain by clicking on the show output chain icon in the toolbar. Cubase 7 makes it incredibly easy to use channel linking. First, select a group of channels to link, then click on the Q-Link button to temporarily link those channels. Now, any parameter you move on one channel affects the entire group. It's as easy as select, Q-Link, and adjust. But there's a lot more here. You can also use the Link button to create a more permanent connection. Use this dialog to select which controls you want to link, and click OK. Now, all of the linked controls respond together, and they keep their relative positions. But what if you want to adjust one parameter in the linked group? Easy. Click the SUS button to temporarily suspend linking. Make the adjustment on the one channel, 
and then click SUS again to restore link and return to adjusting the channels as a group. But what if you don't want to use their relative values? What if you want to set the whole group to a common value? That's just as easy. Click on the ABS button, which stands for Absolute Mode. Now all of the linked channels will snap to the value you select. Cubase 7 includes the famous Voxengo Curve EQ as standard equipment. Voxengo gives you unprecedented precision and the ability to match your EQ to the EQ of any recorded material. You also have unparalleled downmixing quality and detailed control over all of the critical parameters for any level of surround sound your project demands. The new Remote Control Editor allows for custom parameter layouts for advanced remote control units like the Yamaha Nuage Remote Control Surface. It offers a visual editor with various modes for faders, rotaries, and knobs, with lightning fast setup thanks to the Learn mode. To find out more, visit the Cubase product page at www.steinberg.net today.